Hello! Welcome to Adventures in TV Land! For today's adventure, I've kind of stumbled across an unexpected discovery. And I am in Richmond, Missouri. Right now I'm in Richmond Cemetery. And I'm going to check out the graves of two of the three witnesses of the Mormon faith. The first is David Whitmer, who is buried here in Richmond Cemetery. Now, I had actually come out here to the cemetery to visit the grave of an infamous person, the man who shot Jesse James, Bob Ford. And while I was here, I stumbled across another grave here. There's a marker. And so it's like, hey, let's just check it out. So there is this historical marker here. This is David Whitmer, 1805-1888. So one of the three witnesses to the Book of Mormon. Three witnesses were witnesses to verify that you know Joseph Smith, they were there, and the things that were written down, they were true from the, the tablets. And I mean, it's a, I'm not completely familiar with the Mormon faith exactly, but um, that's part of it. So David says David met Joseph Smith on about. June 1st, 1829, learning about him from his work with a mutual friend, Oliver Cowdery. After helping Joseph and his wife, Emma, re relocate from Harmony, Pennsylvania to his parents' home in Fayette, New York, David, uh, David assisted as a scribe in the work of translation. Near the end of June 1829, David was one of the three men shown the plates of gold by an angel named Moroni. They were commanded by a voice from heaven to declare their experience to the world. Known as the Three Witnesses, their testimony has appeared in every edition of the Book of Mormon. David and his other family members were essential to building up the church in New York. They later moved with the church to Kirkland, Ohio. David was among the first Latter-day Saints to move to Missouri, where he served as the president of the church for the area. Although he and other family members separated from the church in 1838, David never denied his testimony. From 1838 till his death in 1888, he lived in Richmond, Missouri. He was known as a man of integrity and served in many civic capacities, including mayor. The gravestone here is a replica. With, with the consent of the living descendants, it was placed in 2021 due to deterioration, and the original marker is in the Ray County Museum. On the other side here, it talks about Mary Whitmer. Mary was David Whitmer's mother, and she is buried here in this area as well and here is the marker marking where both of them are buried on this side here inscribed with Julia's name Died February 25th, 1889, aged 74 years, 18 days. And the other side here is David Whitmer. Died January 25th, 1888, aged 83 years, 20 days. All right, now I'm in Pioneer Cemetery still here in Richmond, Missouri. This is a public cemetery that after about set was abandoned and was left in a state of disarray for about 70 years. And then finally there was some restoration was done and some cleanup and there are, and so Oliver Cowdery, one of the two of the three witnesses along with Joseph Smith of the Book of Mormon is buried here. So really it's not so much a gravestone, it's a giant marker.
And this talks about how there were many members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints that were buried here, including Oliver Cowdery, a close friend of Joseph Smith, one of the three witnesses. The cemetery was abandoned for almost 70 years, and in 1949-1950 cleaned up best as possible, and Oliver Cowdery is buried in this location. Now on this side, David Whitmer's name is inscribed, whom we saw his gravesite earlier. He's buried in Richmond Cemetery here in Richmond. Okay, and on, inscribed here is, you know, for Oliver Cowdery. And on the other side is inscribed with Martin Harris. Harris was the only one of the four men who actually made it to Utah. Well, this has been another adventure in TV land where we visited the graves of two of the three witnesses of the Mormon faith. David Whitmer and Oliver Cowdery, who are both buried here in Richmond, Missouri two separate cemeteries. If you've liked this video, hit the like button. If you disliked, hit the dislike button. Subscribe to my channel for further content and ring that bell for email notifications. And if there's some place that you would like to see me visit or you have a suggestion about some future video you would like to see me do, leave a comment in the comment section. And if you enjoy this adventure or any of the adventures in TV land, you can help support the channel by going to either buy me a coffee or Patreon and making a donation at either or one of those two locations. Thank you for watching. Until next time, that's a wrap.